When a man collapsed on a local dinner cruise, the ship was out on the Hudson River, far away from any place to come in. Time was of the essence, so three Troy firefighters decided to bring help out to him out on the water. Kumi Tucker is here in the studio with us with more on this story. Good evening, Kumi. Good evening, Jim. They thought their best chance might be to get out there fast on a rescue boat, and they somehow had to get onto the ship in the middle of the river on a dark, rainy night. Troy firefighters David Judge, Eric McMahon, and Scott McNaff were on duty Saturday night when the cardiac arrest call came in at about 10 p.m. But the patient was out on the Hudson River. The Captain J.P. dinner cruise was a good way away from any place to dock. We were south of them in Ann's Bridge by about two miles, and that's about midpoint between whether we go back to Albany for emergency help or we continue north back to Troy. Every minute was crucial. Instead of waiting for the ship to come in, they decided to go out. Once the uh, call came in, we, uh, we responded down to the uh, boat dock and uh, the captain made the decision to uh, get on board our boat uh, and meet the Captain JP on the river. Loaded down with advanced life support gear, it wasn't as easy as it sounds. It was warm and sunny when we went out with them here, but it was a far different story for the actual rescue. It was a dark and stormy night. It was raining out. Approaching this large vessel from our little rescue boat was uh, was pretty intimidating, especially, you know, in the pitch black at night. With the ship looming over them, out on the water, they managed to get on board. Firefighters praised the passengers with medical training who had started doing CPR right away. And they themselves are being credited with quick thinking and quick action. They used some initiative, and uh, Captain McMahon suggested that we try this. He took his crew. You know, on the small boat, rendezvous here with the, the Captain JP, and hopefully it has a good outcome. I hope the patient does well. We're told the patient was breathing with assistance, but we don't have any update on his condition. Among the groups on board was the Troy High 25th reunion. Captain McMahon couldn't go that night because he was working, but he ended up being there anyway for a short time. Jessica.